Hello Thunderbirds, welcome back to the art room with Mr. Eck. Today we're going to be continuing our journey through color and uh, revisiting warm and cool colors. So just a reminder, warm colors are colors that remind us of warm or hot things such as yellow like the sun and orange like lava, red like fire. I guess it's all like fire. Anyway, um, yellow to red, these are the warm colors. And then cool colors remind us of things that are cold or cool like cool green grass or running water or purple, I don't know, snow cones. <laughs> anyway, purple is a cool color. So everything green to purple is a cool color. So we're going to be taking those and making a uh, fun new artwork out of it. So let me show you what we're going to do right now. So today we're going to be doing an art project that I think is pretty fun and it's not too hard. It's just kind of uh, a fun reinforcement of warm and cool colors and color mixing. Um, I will be doing my example with paints. If you have paints, you're welcome to do that as well on a single piece of paper. Or if you um, want to do it in your sketchbook, then you can use crayons, uh, color pencils, or markers. So I'm going to first trace my hand. My hand that's flat on the paper needs to stay nice and still. Be sure you separate your fingers a little bit so you can get a, a pencil down in there. Look out for your wedding ring. I know most of you guys are married already, so you got to watch out for that. And when you're doing that, try to keep your, um, your pencil straight up and down if you can. So there's my handprint, and then I'm going to divide my paper horizontally with lines. Uh, you can use a ruler if you want to, or you don't have to, it doesn't have to be perfect. So I'm just going to draw some sideways lines, that's what horizontal means. I'm going to go through the handprint. So I call this project Warm Hands, and that is because there's a phrase that goes, Warm Hands, Warm Heart, which means if you have warm hands, you're a nice caring person, like it's an indicator that you're a good caring person. Um, so with that in mind, we're going to do warm colors inside the handprint and cool colors outside the handprint. And you only have, if you're painting, I want you to only use the primary colors. So that means inside the handprint you can use yellow, you can use red, or you can mix them to make orange. You can make yellowish orange, reddish orange. Depending on how much you mix, you get different oranges. So you have lots of options there for inside the hand. For outside the hand, you have blue, or you can mix blue and yellow to make green, or you can mix blue and red to make purple for the outside. So I'm going to do this on time lapse to save us some time, and let's see how it goes. All right, so this is my finished warm hands painting. Hope you guys uh, have fun making it also. I thought it was pretty fun. Um, I'm gonna explain one thing, those white areas that I left, that's so the colors don't blend together um, unintentionally. If uh, two, wet, uh, two wet colors touch each other, like right down here, they will blend together, which is not a bad thing, but I think the white kind of looks cool and I like to control which colors look exactly like what. But um, if some of your colors blend, it's really fine. In fact, it looks kind of neat, like some un unexpected cool stuff will happen. So uh, the main thing is that you understand which colors are warm, which are cool, and how to use the primary colors to mix those colors. And uh, so anyway, have fun with your reds and yellows and uh, blues and purples and greens. And what's that? Oh, hold on. We have a, a special friend coming in. Uh, yeah, come on over. Come say hi to the kids. So I gotta, I gotta put my mask on, um, you know, because coronavirus. So uh, let's let's welcome uh, my friend. Yeah, come over here. Come say hi. Here he is. Hello, everybody. Hey, it's my friend, Skirmity Frog. 
So, Kermit, what bring what brings you in here, man? Well, I was passing by your room, and I heard you say the word green, and I thought maybe you were talking about me. Uh, actually, no. Um, we were talking about uh, warm and cool colors, and of course, green is a it's a cool color. Um, yeah, that's right. Because frogs are pretty cool, and frogs are green. I can't argue with that. So anyway, um, Kermit, you have anything to add? Just be sure to uh, clean off your brushes in between uh, colors, because that makes a big mess. And uh, clear connections, friends. Don't forget to uh, take a picture and upload it for Mr. Eck to look at. Uh, that's all I've got. Okay, well, uh, thank you, Kermit. I appreciate your help. Um, friends, have fun painting. I'll see you next time.